Are you tired of typing on your keyboard? Do you find yourself feeling frustrated at your slow typing speed? You may have heard about the Colmac layout or the Dvorak layout or whatever layout that you've heard of on whatever forum or whatever Reddit post that you've seen, and you'd wonder to yourself, well, is this the solution to all my typing problems? I personally do not think it is. To some people, sure, like myself included, but to you, no. Like, steer away from this layout. Even though Colmac is an amazing layout, it is also an amazing waste of fucking time. Firstly, while Colmac may be more efficient in theory, it can take a significant amount of time to learn the damn thing. It will most certainly kill your productivity for a while, maybe for a few weeks, maybe for even a few months. It certainly did for me. I was so frustrated and oblivious at learning this new keyboard layout at first for the first few days. I had to literally constantly think about which key to press on the keyboard, being careful what key that's going to be, constantly looking at a reference image, and suffering from the slow two words per minute sometimes, because I couldn't even type a single sentence. In dealing with that whole frustration, I wanted to go back to my old keyboard layout so quickly, because I was typing on an average of 139 words per minute on QWERTY. But I knew in my mind I probably shouldn't because long term this was going to be a really good investment for me. And I'm usually the person that never seems to give up anyways. Okay, but if I'm telling you if this was good for me, why isn't it good for you? Well, because you see, I actually have a legitimate reason. I know most of you are going to do this to improve your speed. Don't fucking do this. Do not waste your time doing this. My legitimate reason is that I actually have hand pain. You see, when I was typing in QWERTY, I would constantly feel that tension on the side of my arm. So I switched to a more split keyboard. And not only that, I switched to a new layout entirely as I was learning how to type on my new split keyboard. And honestly, when I was learning to type this new layout, now that I'm a more comfortable speed, it is really comfortable to type on this layout. My hands feel way better typing on this layout, and that's probably the only reason why I feel like there is a major improvement, because one, it's split, and two, it's a more efficient layout. To most people, this is just a big waste of time. If your hands are not hurting with QWERTY, stick with QWERTY, dude. Most of you that are probably watching this are probably looking at the damn keyboard when you're typing. That is a major sin within itself. Do not fucking do this. If you're going to want to learn how to type fast, even on your regular keyboard layout, do not look at the damn keyboard. It slows you down so much, and it, it did for me when I was learning how to type on a regular keyboard many years ago. But anyways, the most used English letters are on the home row with Colmac, while the most used English letters with QWERTY are all over the damn place. So it was obvious for me that I had to learn something like this to reduce the finger travel when typing on my keyboard. To really summarize this video, okay, to really summarize this video, the only reason you should be switching to Colmac or Dvorak or whatever fuck alternative layout is because you're generally concerned about your health, or you like doing very difficult tasks and you think it's fun to learn another layout. If that's the case, then what's wrong with you? Have some respect for yourself and just learn how to type fast and QWERTY.